two snakes and a bass. Hey, how's it going? Outdoor Vector here. So I'd been out to this Bull Creek area before and had some pretty good success catching some sunfish on a Tenkara setup. But I did also see some big bass out here. And so I wanted to come back and specifically target trying to catch some of those big bass. Definitely some bigger sunfish here. Little bass I see. I don't see any big guys yet. I saw some just, just up there. Uh huh. Underneath, underneath one of the trees, it's like a hole in the ground. Oh, okay. And it's like it's like shallow all around it, and there's, there's a hole. There's a big hole, yeah. Uh, they hang out there a lot. I've, I've never been able to catch one of them. Cool. I think it's because the water's clear and they can see it. Yeah, they can probably see you. That's why I'm trying to stay away from the bank as much as I can just to see. Yeah. Well, yeah. good luck to you, man. <laughs> there. I'm gonna try to use this crawbugger. And try not to get tangled up while I'm trying at the same time. So in this area you can tell there's a lot of tree overhang and so a lot of times I had to use the uh, bow and arrow cast which I'm about to try to do here and I also did a lot of roll casting while I was uh, all along this uh, Bull Creek area. There's one big bass in here I saw, just for a brief glimpse. He swam under this tree. for him to pat back. Oh, there he is. There he is, he's right under the tree. Right past the right end of this bush, you can see him. Try to arrow this in. It's right against the bank right now. Right against the bank. Try to stay low.
yes, there he is. He's not, doesn't see it. So I just couldn't seem to get the big bass to bite or really have any interest in the crop bugger. They would just swim right by. But I did generate a lot of interest from the sunfish. Oh, snake coming. Two snakes and a bass. There's the big guy. Don't want to eat. Dang, there he is. They're, they're right under the tree. So since the Kronberger wasn't generating any interest subsurface, I decided to give uh, a topwater popper a try. Oh man. Interest, there's interest. Gotta get these guys to bite. I mean, there's a couple guys here that are interested in this popper, but they just, they come up to it and then go away. Yeah, these guys have moved on. They're usually right, they kind of hug the bank here and then they come out every once in a while. But yeah. All right, man. See ya. I do. You can check it out at Outdoor Vector. Yeah, check it out. Um, nope. Just, just one word. Outdoor Vector. All right, man. Thanks. Well, I didn't have too much luck today actually catching any big bass, but it was fun just to get out and hike and explore and give it a try. It was also kind of fun just to try to target a specific species and see if you can get one of them. I think this place is actually pretty heavily fished. There was a lot of traffic on the trails. Um, some days you just won't hook up. But it's still great to just get out there. Till next time, have a great time outdoors. <laughs>